Nicole Scott here from Mobile Geeks, and today I'm going to be reviewing a wearable from Intel. This one was given away at IDF back in September. It is the SM Audios. These are headphones with a heart rate monitor built in. And a spoiler alert, this is a wearable that doesn't suck. So let's take a look at what's inside the box. So there we've got the headphones. Over here we have a user's manual sticker. This only works with RunKeeper and where you can pick it up. It also comes with a carrying case and inside you can find different size earbuds. The earbud them itself is pretty decently sized. Now if you put as soon as you put this in your ear it's gonna get dirty. It looks it already looks like it's collecting a little bit of fluff so if you're really concerned about having dirty looking earbuds this is not the product for you but so there's not actually that much to the controls if you want to turn it on and off you just flip that up that's for your heart rate so when it comes to using the headset as a remote control a single press will play another press will pause double press for next track then we have triple press for previous track there we go, triple press for previous track, and a long press does voice activation like Google Now. So you actually get a bunch of uh, different size earpieces from large, which I think is the one that comes default, to small. I've actually gone with a, a medium size, which is on here. You can't actually, sorry, it's on here. The size difference isn't that apparent, but it makes a quite a big difference in here. I'm just gonna show you how you change that off. So here is, just the earbud and then when you have your little earpiece it goes in and it's facing down it's quite a snug fit and there you go with the headphones in I've decided to run in place and not a chance and I'm going to show you what I look like doing that you can see that my heart rate does change real time all I had to do was flip the switch and there I go So this was just a quick ears on. Uh, we're gonna have a full more detailed review later. I just wanted to give you my first impressions and well, they are, it doesn't suck. The heart rate seems to be pretty accurate. I mean, I'm counting my pulse with the stopwatch and I seem to be pretty on par. Uh, the only thing that I wish that they had was more apps that it worked with. Right now it's just RunKeeper and if you don't use RunKeeper then you have to start using it in order to use these. Personally, I use um, the Polar Heart Rate Monitor and I use Noom's Weight Loss Coach whenever I'm doing stuff like that. So I would love to see Noom just because that's the one that I use, but I hear that we're gonna be getting a lot more app compatibility in the very near future. The only other negative is on this little band, you can control the music, you can flip it up to get your heart rate, but you can't control the volume. Uh, you have to do that on the phone. Not such a big deal, but if you're used to adjusting the volume on your head headset, then it's something that you are going to miss. So this has just been a quick ears on with the SMS audio headset um, that we got from Intel's IDF. I'm Nicole Scott, and if you'd like to see something in the full review, let me know in the comments because I will be ears on for these for the next, well, until I achieve my fitness goals. So probably forever. Yeah.